Hey guys, I just wanted to do a quick review of the JJRC H12C and I've had this drone for about three weeks now and I love it. It is a fun little drone. It stays in the air about four and a half minutes and it has a 1080p camera attached to the bottom of it. It also has a six way or six axis gyro, excuse me, and really works very, very well for the price. It was about $35 from Banggood when I ordered it, and it came with an, a spare sp set of rotors, a screwdriver, the charge cables, and uh, the camera SD card, or micro SD card, and the battery, of course. The micro SD that they include is a generic 4 gig card, so we'll, we'll be recording the flight today. So let's, let's take it up in the air. What we're going to do first is just turn this turn this on. You see the lights blinking. So that's ready to go. On the controller, I'm turning that on. And we bind the controller to the drone. And the lights blink once there. And I don't know if you can see it, but there's a green light in there. It's ready to record. It, that light will start blinking red when the recording is actually started. So let's let's take this out. The camera I'm using is an action camera, and it's mounted to the to the top of my hat. So here goes. Okay, so that was just flying it a little bit. I'm going to bring it back over here. Set her down. And we are going to record this one. So here we go. It's a fun little drone to fly, seriously. It's, again, I've been only flying for about three weeks, four weeks now, three weeks, and uh, I can control this reasonably well. I'm still no, no professional at flying these things, but this is cool, and I'm enjoying it. Now see, I don't know if you can see it, let me bring it back this way. If you can see it, see how the lights are blinking? I got about a minute and a half before, well a minute before the, before the battery gives out. So I'm going to, I'm going to land it right now. And stop the video, just so that we know we don't lose that. And we're just going to have a little fun until the battery runs out. Now that battery was charged about six hours ago. And something that I've noticed is that the, when you do have a battery that's charged uh, and then you have it sitting around for a while, it seems to lose some of the charge on this. Don't know why that is, but that's just how it goes.
Yeah, I can feel it. It's starting to lose its power now. It becomes a lot more finicky as it loses its power. Let me take some still photos real quick. We'll try and get a still shot in there. Oops, a little bit too low. Uh, and with that, all the lights went out, and I think that was the end of that battery. So, let's go grab the other battery. Okay, hats on. Here we go again. Turn the drone on. Power this up. Ah, that one didn't take. Let's try again. Turn it off. Turn it back on. Come on. There we go. Maybe if I set it down. Yep. Woo! Yeah, that worked. And look at that. The camera managed to dislodge itself. Well, good so I can show you. Uh, the camera just go, slides in and back. So I'm guessing that loosened up with, oops, it loosened up with having to change the battery. Something, something that would be good to check, I suppose. And then, oh, on this camera, it's really kind of cool. You can adjust the up and down angle of the camera itself because the the actual housing swivels a little bit so anyway here we go hit the record okay now it has a little bit of forward momentum uh, come back here yep still trying to trim it off to come back a little bit Yeah, that's probably about as good as it's going to get. So here we go. This this drone can get come can get right back up after it after it crashes. But then again, I'm not hitting very hard either, which is a good thing. Okay, I just hit advanced mode, and you'll notice that, woo, that the drone is a lot more responsive, a lot more responsive. So, unless you're really good at it, unless you've got some time under your belt, maybe using the advanced mode isn't isn't good because you're more. Uh, the drone reacts a lot faster and and uh, you have the, a much better chance of crashing into something or just nose diving right into the ground if you're if you're not so lucky so I'm back in beginner mode right now and it's much easier to control for me
might as well stop the video while we can. There we go. Ooh, so much fun. Wow. Hello. Almost crashed. Well, bumped the ground. And that's probably going to be it. I don't think we're going to get any more, uh, anything else out of this one. Yep. It's not even responding. So we're going to shut it down. And I hope you enjoyed that. That's the JJRC H H12C, and it's a good little good little drone. And I'm glad I got it. I'm glad I got it. 